this game. We got five Rexius and XG Suite. It's two old school Dish Jam players. Formerly two of the the number one and number two disputable which one was which. But here we go, and the match is starting. So Q... Yep, and I I have not had the opportunity to see these guys play live very much, so I am soaking it up. Yeah, it's gonna so be a huge, huge, huge juice war. I almost said a douche war, <laughs> but it's a juice war. <laughs> Well, we do have two max, and like you said earlier, you do like the mirror matches, which is always, I think that always makes it a nice even, um, to make sure that there's not any, uh, you know, exploiting going on, or, or putting kind of mismatches between, so mirror matches are always great. That's an amazing grab on that super, and the rally is already up to 21 points, and uh, our exodus is now juiced, we've got a hop, and now we've got a, oh, a nice little, uh, like a little punch shot kind of a sidewall there, and uh, our exodus is up 24 nothing. Yeah, and it's one of those things that XG Sweet did have to slide there, lost it, he was fine, knew he had the shot. Maybe XG Sweet was just giving up the point, but anyways, Fi got the score. Yep, and XG Sweet has to slide again for that that hop and uh, ends up kind of on the downside of, a, of another rally. He's up down 36-0 now. Yeah, and it, he, you can see a little bit of the rust still coming off from XG Sweet. He might have taken care of the hop, but that's, that's a... That's a yeah, yeah. Now he's getting on, gets on the board after that nice little wall right down the side wall. Is that 36-13 now? They're going to exchange a couple of shots. It's going to pop that one up and go for a filth. And Fire X is going to get juiced. Catches that. It's a short hop. They're both juiced again. They got a juice, a little bit of a juice battle now. 12 on the rally. Black nice. Nice hitting over there with the wall right. And wall right back and just get it past him up 49-13. Yeah, and Fi at that turn 40 right, 9 right now. But he is showing some dominance over XGC. We'll see what he yeah. can do to do that. Yeah, it definitely feels like Pyrexis has been in control of, uh, of the match so far. But there he goes with like a predict on a pop super, and XG goes cross court to filth and gets, uh, gets, on the, gets up to 26 points. Coming back. Yeah, definitely making that comeback. Beautiful, beautiful carrot gold filth right there. Yeah, we can Pyrexis play around with some other techniques now. Kind of went aggro there a little bit. Had to jump back. So XG is juiced. Pyrexis catches up with him there. He's juiced as well. A couple nice filth shots, but the both these guys are getting to him. Wall right. Pyrexis answers back now. And, oh, Hop throwing. Oh, XG, I was ac accidentally maybe hit the button on that one? Looks like yeah. he hit, slid pretty early there. I, I'd say he actually got fooled by that, uh, that skinny hop. He thought he was going to the actual build. But no, it came back towards that same wall. Now the player XG's. So that puts that first, uh, first thing down. And for Xeus, looks like he just kind of took off towards the bleachers on that one. Just gave up the 13 points. Yeah, it Hold seemed like he was predicting, and yeah, he's sweet for scoring again. Once again, probably on a Fire Exeus prediction. Yeah, yeah. A couple of short hops by each player, and they're both juicing to wall ride. XG Sweet's on the other side of the court. And these points these points are coming pretty quickly now. Uh, at XG Sweet's up 19 to 11. Uh, Fire Exeus with a nice little hop there, and then a short hop. Another short hop answer. They're both juiced again, just like he called. A couple, of, a couple of nice knuckle balls, and uh, he just slips that one by and goes up 25-19. <laughs> Wall right, a nice big quick curve. He's just actually easily handled. A short hop, and yep, right off that back panel, that one panel, and uh, goes in. The end zone. Actually, sweet with the short hop. Now a nice little short side fill. Phyrexius and 45-19. Uh, it's always just going to come right up and just just finish it right off. Put it right away. That That's stuff on the serve, that something, once again, should never happen. <laughs> but it does, and Phi takes game one. So we saw a lot from Phi there, a lot from XG Suite. I'm looking forward to this game too here. See if XG Suite can actually uh, step up and take the game here. We know that he is quite rusty. He hasn't played in several months. Uh, I mentioned it to him a lot when he was ending his stream today, so that might be why he came in for this stream right now. Well, I think we're happy to have him. It's fun to, it's fun to see a lot of the, uh, the OG players. Um, like that, come back and, and start picking the game back up again. Kind of show SFNGs uh, how the game's really played in some cases. So it's uh, it's been a lot of fun to watch. But Rex just answers that wall away, and then it comes. To, oh, it's a little short hop there by XG. XG's just going to throw a post shot. XG's going to throw another post shot for XG. Getting these pretty easily. Popping that one up. He's going to both juice the full shot. Another full shot. XG just has to slide for that. Now XG's got the advantage, and a skinny hop. He's got it. Thirty-nine to nothing. 
Yeah, and you saw that once Fi slided, he looked defeated, just kind of sat there on his serving circle. Let that go by. Actually, so we got the point. Yeah, that was a little surprise. I think for that was kind of surprise for us is that he got nine points on that one. It wasn't a very difficult shot to get. XG looks like he just short armed it. And again, I think he probably uh, probably expected to hit XG to get that one as well, but he did not. So uh, it's now 39 to 17. A couple of short rallies though. Still got that 39 points that he got at that first one. So he's still in pretty good shape now. He has to slide for that one. Ferris is his juice. He's in that corner. He's going to go filth. I she was ready for that one. He's going to wall right now. Like a, like a knuckleball, bank shot kind of a thing. And then uh, and just, uh, just again, the juice just catches up. And he's back within six points. Yeah, and right now you see Sweet getting very greedy. I'm not going to call it out every time. Please. But uh, it looked like Fi actually might have gotten greedy. That one was there. Yeah, that was, that was an interesting one. Um, like I said, a little rust maybe still on some, both of these guys, but wow, just some like, cr crazy top-notch uh, gameplay other than just a few little short arms here and there. And uh, it's just amazing. So there's a, there's a lob going to get XG back on the baseline. Eryxis is kind of thrown white now. He's, he knows he's kind of down and he's got to try to get the pre-read that filth, and he did. He tried to get this juice built back up. It looks like he's going to. 21 points, and that's going to do it. He's going to take that set. Wow, what a comeback. Yeah. And right there, when he was able to build up two and make sweet slide, that was the home run that he needed. He knew that with his, he's going to get juice and get that score. He does to win the set. The ball raid by Sweet. Pirates just pops that up. With a pocket shot. And the other fill shot. Pocket shot by Sweet. Sweet's going to go fill. And Pirates just is juiced. XG is just Sweet is juiced. And 16 points on the clock. It's a beautiful skimming fill. Yeah, and those skimming filths, they can be very dangerous because they're going to hit that back panel. That's one of the most dangerous panels to hit because you slide to that corner and you're going to miss it because you're going to be in that obvious way. Yeah, yeah, really nice throw. So Fikes is going to pop that up that hash like the technique that you said uh, that you mentioned earlier. A lot of the OG players like to use. Fikes is juice going to go filth cross. Sweet's going to answer with a filth. Fikes has to slide. Now he's da he's, he's down and he's juice counting. I don't know. He just kind of uh, I don't know if he kind of let that one go by, but he's down 45 to nothing now. Yeah, I think that was a strategic give. He wasn't being greedy. If he got there, he got there. If not, he didn't want the rally to get up to the point where he would be 50. No, Phyrexis is juiced now, and he can't reach that short hop right on the first panel, and that's going to be a jam. Get your butter, get your bread. We got jam for that toast. XG Sweet with the wall right. Phyrexis is going to answer with a short hop. Sweet with another uh, another little back panel. Really nice throw, but Phyrexis gets to that one as well. But now, oh, he short arms another one uh, on a nice fill shot from XG Sweet, and he's down 12 to nothing. Got quite a series of uh, rallies that have gone XG Sweet's away now. Yes, but I will have to interrupt you because I have to welcome Dr. Whistler to the Barrio Brothers. Welcome, Dr. Whistler. Hey. Hey, Whistler, how's it going? I'm assuming we'll uh, be doing another Friday Night Jams this week. Those are always fun. King of the court action. Phyrexis is now juiced. Actually, Sweet's going to go fill cross court. And Phyrexis is going to answer the same wall right. Phyrexis got wall right back. Fill the cross. What a nice choice of throws. And he goes up 29 to 11. Yeah, when you get something that perfect off the juice, like actually Sweet just threw, and if Phi isn't centered up, you know that's going for it. A little style on the Phyrexius on the pop and super there. He's juice is going to come back to filth and 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 really XG Sweet just couldn't get couldn't reach that one. And now uh, now Phyrexius starting to claw his way back into this and down five points. He's going to get to that filth, pop it up. Uh, oh, here comes XG Sweet and answer on a filth straight down the sideline. XG Sweet's got that one. Phyrexius is going to go with the post shot. He's going to filth and not not a perfect filth, but. Certainly good enough with the juice to then go up 42-24. Yeah, and that's one of the things you can see with these two players who are very old school players. It's going to come down to a lot of juice battles, and they are playing Mac v v Mac. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A nice easy serve there. Phyrexis answers the fill. Short hop. Phyrexis goes back to go, but it's blue. And now XG Sweet is juiced. He's got 10 points. It's going to be 11 points on this super throw. Phyrexis answers with a counter. A third counter. Wow, back and forth. Boy, these guys know where this is going. Nice fill serve from XG Sweet. And he's going to go back and get lobbed back. Phyrexis desperately wants to get his juice counter started building back up again. A couple of wall rights back and forth. Mm, 21 points. Whew, what an exchange. Um, I don't know, man. I don't know. How, how does nobody drop a boom on that one? Man. I have no idea. Three, two counters, 
on supers. But both players just, have discs now, so this is going to be our final game of this match. Right now, the points 213 to 210, extremely even, separated by three points. Both players playing Mac, both players on the spiral. It's a wonderful thing to see mirror matches and these two players do. Yep, definitely. Let's see who's going to go Phil for Exus catches that one. He's a short hop back across. the wall right for Exus gets mad. He's juiced. It's actually sweet is juiced. we got 10 points of the rally clock. There's a Phil throw. Another Phil throw. Now for Exus has to slide. He's going to be down now in the juice battle. He slides again. Throwing blues. Let's who's going to pop that up for Phil. Oh, what a nice Phil skimming throw off the back two pounds. He's up 16 and nothing. Yeah, if you get that skimming saw blade Phil right there, it's almost uh. impossible to get to. And Pyrex just misjudged that one. He's down 22. Pyrex just misjudged that one. And actually, Sweet is up 22 to nothing. And he's going to go up 30 to nothing. And, and Pyrex seems a little bit off all of a sudden. He needs to do something to kind of get the, himself back into this. Yeah. There he tried to get so fancy and, and then just missed the disc. So um, yeah. Greedy. That was uh, that was interesting. So down 36 to nothing. I think we'll see, uh, see if he really pushes for this one or whether he goes to some of those strategic... Uh, strategic retreat type of games, but uh, he's got 11 points on that exchange. Yeah, and right now, Sweet still in the lead on this set. It's kind of do or die. Pyrex is in the lead right now. He does have to slide them. Yeah, Pyrex is going to be down again in the juice. Well, this is a position he's been in a little bit in this particular match. 17 points on the rally, though, now, and HG Sweet thought he's just trying to rebuild his juice now. It's nice fill throws with everybody. Oh, and a skinny hop. Nice choice to go to that. I haven't seen a ton of those. And he pulls it out right when he needed it. He's only down three. That's basically tied, right? Yeah, basically tied here in this jam with the way the scoring works. And that's one thing you'll see. A lot of the old school players, when you talk about a matchup like this, will tell you first to lose Juice has a nice chance of losing the round. Well, there was a nice short hop on that one, and that's going to get Pyrexius the 11 point lead. He just really just needs the one rally now, obviously. So he's going to throw a blue there. Going to actually Sweet's going to get some Juice. Oh, he needed a slide there, and he thought he could reach it. And he loses the set, 57-36. Yeah, big set for Phi there after he did lose to the last game in this match. So he is on basically game or match point, whereas Sweet has to win two sets here to continue. Yep. And Phyrexius gets six G Sweet to slide, throws a blue, and he pops super on it. It's up 14 to nothing. So that's a nice little hop throw. He's going to answer with a short hop. Another short hop. Phyrexius rushes the net, grabs it, and then just quick curves at 22-0. Yeah, and right now Phyrexia is flexing his muscles. He, like you said, 22-0. And he is just taking it too sweet, saying, You're rusty. I'm the better player here. Let's get this done. Well, a nice serve there. Gets Phyrexia to, uh, to dive right off the bat. And now it's actually sweet with a nice juiced fill throw. And he's going to he's gonna kind of get, uh, get nine points on that. I, I feel like he's uh, he's getting that going. His fill throws have really been on point. He's had a couple of really nice skimmers. I think if he can dial that in just a little bit, he's going to be right back in this thing. Right now, he's getting Phyrexia just to run around with some, catching some logs, his juice. I think he's just trying to get re, uh, refocused here. A couple of nice fill throws. If he gets Phyrexia to dive for it, he's going to get under the lobby. Jimmy Charles is down the side. He's got it. He's right back in this 30-20. Yeah, and right there, that slide sealed it for him. Actually, Sweet able to sit on that lob, get the saw blade super. And, and Phyrexius now is juiced. I think he really wanted that super, but he wasn't really quite on the spot. Couldn't get it charged up. Phyrexius is going to short hop this across. They're both juiced. we got 15 points on the clock. Oh, there it is. A nice short hop, and he's up 45-25. Yeah, this is going to be advantage for Phyrexius here. Any disc that he scores from here on out will win him the entirety of the match. Actually, Sweet has a long ways to go to get that. Nice kill throw gets Phyrexius there to slide. And actually, Sweet's going to try to move him around, see if he can take advantage of this nice wall right. Phyrexius has to slide again. He's going to throw blue. You got to wonder if actually Sweet wants to... Oh, what, a, what an oh, aggressive oh. slide through. And he, and he gets it. He cuts off that cross court tilt and gets it. He knew Sweet was coming with that filth. He pre-slides, stands up, grabs the disc, and quick curves it down the line for the win. Yet another amazing game, ladies and gentlemen. Phyrexia is taking that one in three, but Sweet showing that there's not much rust to shake off. And if there is a lot of rust, guess what? Everybody should be scared, because if he gets back in, he's going to wreck some face. Yep, that was a really, you saw, you saw a lot of really nice juice battling in that one and a lot of nice technique and just intelligent, smart play.
just yeah. all the way around. Yeah, definitely. And I love seeing those old school players come back. I have commentated, done play by play, done analysis, the, and this exact match, I don't know how many times, but every time it's still fun to watch, still fun to talk about. So that is going to be that match. What is that, six or seven matches on the night? 